Hello, and welcome back to Ori and the Will of the Wisps. After a very, very long time. So long that I'm kind of afraid. I'm probably very rusty at this, but it's been, been a while. I kind of took a big break from this, but we still have some achievements left to get. And I'm thinking I'll try and get some of them. And I think I'm probably biting off more than I can chew, because I'm thinking, why not try hard mode? without touching any water, without equipping a shard, and without spending spirit light. Surely there can't go, nothing can go wrong with that. I'm probably not going to worry about the time, but th that seems totally reasonable and definitely not like a, a decision I'll just regret instantly, but I suppose we don't know how hard hard mode is. And if hard mode turns out to be just torture, then I can switch it. Right? I can switch it like mid-game, but you just can't switch back or something. Or you can switch back, but you wouldn't get the achievements, I think. Something like that. So, worst case scenario, we could try and do these three primarily. And if hard mode is too hard, we switch it over to easy. And then it could actually work. So, that's the plan. We'll see how it goes. Again, rust. Very, uh, very rusty. The water is super easy. There's only grape juice here. <laughs> that's true. But yeah, I think I think the water one is actually super easy because I believe there was it was only like one time I actually touched the poison water before I cleansed it or something like that. It was not much. It was just like, whoops, I touched it, failed that achievement. But maybe not. Maybe I'm misremembering. But yeah, let's let's get into it and let's try hard mode. Oh boy. Are you sure? Nope. And we can skip the prologue. Good. We can not. Oh, God. Nice voice crack. Wow. Not skip this. Yeah, we're dead. Game over. There was a time when you went to touch it to check. See anything in the wellspring area? Can't really remember that, but yeah, that's probably right. All right. Let's just go for it right away. So, I mean, collecting these is pointless in that case, if I'm not going to be uh, collecting any spirit light or like using any spirit light. Uh, is anything here? Oh, really? Wait, what? Then what happens if you go to the right there? You just can't? I guess that would just be a dead end. Huh. Well, I'm sure it's fine. All right. We got a weapon. Ow. Wait. Oh, shit. All my controls are, like, reset? Because this is a, a new save? Really? All right. We're back. Controls are working again. We got Torch again. I thought I had my attack on right bumper, but that was only in Ori 1. Because of the, uh, like, I had heavy attack on Y and stuff like that. So, I think it's actually totally fine. It's how it's supposed to be. Oh, you can't attack downward with the uh, the torch. I didn't even know that. Oh, we need to find those. Yeah. Right, there was this switch. I think this one was like much later on. It's not just something I can do right now, right? Just because I know of it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was something in a late game. See, I should have done this early. Early, like after beating it, then I would have remembered everything. Hey, guy.
Ah, oh, crap. Oh my god. Wow. Okay, that's hard mode for you, I suppose. Don't touch spikes. And also use the, uh, the attack to, like, maintain your momentum a little bit. Are you collecting spirit light? I mean, I'm not intentionally really collecting it. But then again, I also just can't remember what was where, so I'm definitely gonna go for secrets and stuff, because they might be life cells. Like, I have no idea. But I guess I could just ignore enemies. That would be a thing. I just kind of feel like I want to play it safe and clear everything out, since it's hard mode after all. Alright, now this thing. Crap. Oh man, two hits and you're dead? Just let him burn to death, that's fine. At least I don't need to never die. That's totally fine. In this run, anyway. Oh, my torch, of course. I forget. I forgot you uh, lose the torch there. Oh, no. Oh, God. Well, might as well die again. Oh, just walked into that. Whatever, let's die again. This is not a deathless run. There we go. Yeah, this is infinite death percent. Gotta get as many deaths as fast as possible. Or as many as I can. I wonder if that boss is just gonna, like, one-shot me or something? We'll see. Not sure why I took why why am I taking damage here? Like I guess I have to jump. Oh, whoops. Oh man. Well, he's not one-shotting me at least. That's something. Okay, you have to like really pull back there, just do like one hit. Yeah, just do one hit at a time, I guess. I think after the bite I can get two, but after the swipe, only one. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that, that seemed pretty forgiving, at least, for being hard mode. Like, I, I kind of sucked there and still worked out. Now I'm going to die on the way back, though. Can't even break this. I have no weapon. 
Here we go. Well, I guess this is our main weapon for the entire run because I can't buy the hammer or anything like that. We're just gonna have this and like the bow and the feather. Yeah, this is gonna be the main thing to use. I have to get really good at hit and run. Can I skip this? Yes, I can. Nice. That is nice. But you can skip whatever you want. And we got full health as well. Oh man, yeah, they do a lot of damage. Ah, okay, you can't just like bunny hop or pogo infinitely on them. I mean, so far, just from the beginning, I don't even know why I collect those. That's also pointless, but you might as well get them, I suppose. Just have to not equip them. What was I saying? I don't even know. Yes, uh, right. So far, I don't feel like the amount of damage I'm taking is, like, unreasonable. Like, spikes kill you in one or two hits. That's kind of fine. Enemies don't seem insane, but we'll see. Might get worse. Especially when, like, at this point, I'm not supposed to have shards or upgrades that help in combat. So once I get to that point where I don't have that, and you're supposed to, might get a little uh, dicier. Don't have that. Where do we go now? Out. Yeah, like two hits from this guy. You have to be careful. I guess I missed something. No? Where am I supposed to get these keystones from? I already forgot. It must have been to the left. Yeah, it's not here. Need to go down? Down here? Oh. oh! I didn't even realize this was a way you could even go. Nice combo. Right, this whole thing. Do we have purple water yet? Oh, crap. Well, that's fine. I get healed. Ow. 
Ow. Yeah, so far not bad. At least it doesn't seem like they've reduced the amount of healing enemies drop and stuff. So it's like very punishing, but also you get rewarded for success, which seems kind of nice. Because, yeah, I vaguely remember, like, wasn't that a thing in Ori 1 where hard mode, you just never got health drops? Like, they were just turned off from enemies. You had to make do with the ones in the environment. And it was a little frustrating. What was this again? Double jump? I think. Yeah. Don't need this, but we need it. Sword, bow, feather, and heal are all the things you get without spirit light. Yeah, I mean... Heal is going to be nice to have, at least. Yeah, like, heal plus bow? Not a terrible combination. I was just going to say, the bow can be made pretty good with shards. Oh, we're not using those either. Yeah, it'll, it'll be something. And I guess you can still get those, like, permanent damage upgrades that you can find somewhere. Those just happen. You don't have to equip them. Was I down here? Oh, no. No, thank, thank you. No, I haven't been here. So, how do you break rocks and stuff? I guess we have to wait until we get... Uh, what is it that can do that? That isn't the hammer? There's like something else that can break rocks. I mean, spike can. Spike and hammer, but... Isn't there something else? That you get by default? Oh, this is for a spirit shard. Yeah, I guess so, but... I can. I feel like I might as well collect some secrets and stuff just to like clean up the map eventually but yeah oh wait no this was a keystone wait which one did you mean was for a spirit shard wait so where are we going now just back up that was all I needed I guess Yeah, I, I also thought that was a spirit shard at first. Just gonna kill this guy because he's gonna cause issues. But I, I still need one more. Shit. So where am I missing another one? Oh, right, now I have double jump. Right, right, right. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, there we go. Alright, yeah. Here, I think I touched the poison water instantly. So now I, I should be careful about that. Don't want to touch poison if I can help it. But if I fail that one, oh well. I'm not going to be, like, too upset about it. Like, I'll, I'll try and do that if I can, but I'm not, not resetting if I don't get it. 
Uh, I guess this is where we're going, and this is something extra. Don't remember what this was. Poison water. Ooh. This I think this might have been a health thing or something. Try to avoid secrets. I mean, I could just also avoid the poison water in the secrets. Because I want these ones. Because, yeah. If I need to do a, another run for the poison water, I, I guess I could just do that on easy mode. And, like, only focus on that. So, I'm not too concerned with it. I'd rather collect as much health and that stuff as I can. Just to make sure I have the best chance of completing hard mode. But I suppose you could just avoid the secrets right now until you cleanse the water. Because you, you get the achievement right when you cleanse the water, right? It's not like you have to play the entire game before you get it. Oh! Did, did I just touch it? Does that count? I didn't take damage from it, but that might have might have already failed it. If so, then whatever, I guess. Like I don't know what I could do. If I if I quit now, would it undo me touching that? Probably not. So, yeah, whatever. Fuck the touching not touching poison water thing anyway. It's kind of a dumb achievement in my opinion. But, we can always do it in easy mode at some point. But, I mean, I didn't take damage from it, so... No idea. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, damn. Well... Yeah, hopefully it's just like, you take no damage from poison water. God, these are weird sometimes. There's not a secret here, is there? Nope. Hmm. Is this even anything I can do right now? Yeah, I guess so. I guess it's kind of pointless to do most side quests as well. I think the majority of them are just Spirit Light. Oh no, right, Gorlick Ore. Yeah, that, that can help. Ah, this guy's a little annoying. Here we go. Oh, this one looks kind of weird. Why does this one look special? Let's regenerate. Hmm.
So are we back somewhere I've been already? Yeah. And, well, I missed that, but oh well. Let's just go onward for now. I guess going left is kind of pointless at this point, I think. I did that the first time, and I don't think you really... Oh, never mind, it's not here. I'm thinking, uh... Wait! H hold on! Can, can I buy maps? It's upgrades, right? No. Beat the game without spending any spirit light. Okay, so I can't even buy maps at all. Alright. I guess that's not really a big deal. Yeah, I was thinking a bit further to the left here, there's another path. Yeah, like right here. Yeah, this is something I probably shouldn't bother with right now. Don't remember what's here, but yeah. Let's leave it for now. Yeah, here. Going left from here, I believe, is kind of pointless. Let's just go right where I'm supposed to. Hello, monkey. No, 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 stop. <laughs> I was just spamming the button. Shouldn't do that. Can you not jump up here? Oh, I think you can. There we go. I guess that's fine. Combat shrines are useless since you can't equip shards. Yeah, I can just skip all the combat shrines. Isn't there a quest you get from him for combat shrines? I guess I didn't get that. It was the rumor, yeah. Skip this, yep. But now we need the eyes, I think. Yeah, so I should just spam B to talk to people, just in case they ask me if I want to, like, buy stuff, and I accidentally, like, flip over to yes. Time. Yeah, now we basically have our full arsenal for the rest of the game. Yeah, there's a secret here. If that's what you meant. Right. 
No, god damn it. There we go. What? Wait, huh? How do I get up again? <laughs> I can stand on this. Why is it not letting me stand there? I guess you're just supposed to stand on it to begin with. I thought I jumped up just fine. Oh. Are these like faster in hard mode or something? I wouldn't think they would be, but I don't know. Hey, come over here. <laughs> there you go. All right. There was some poison water in here, but again, I, I might already have failed that, so we'll see how it goes. Don't really need to talk to this guy. Yeah, don't want to buy anything. Ow. He almost knocked me into the poison. Is that secret of fragments? I don't know what secret. This one up here? I think this is an energy shard. But I can't remember how to get in here. Well, you can just skip that. Yeah, was there a secret here? Oh. Oh, this one, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot about this one. Yeah, okay. It was he health, not energy. But isn't there health up there as well? I want to say there's another secret here. Maybe not. Like up, up here? I can't really remember. Yeah, health upgrade is nice. I guess I don't need to do that. And I can't get across to here. Wait, can I? Is that a thing you can cheese already? Oh, wait, wait. Maybe if I don't do the last swing there and just wall, wall jump instead? Hold on, I got a better jump before. No! No, 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 no. Well, that's fine. It wasn't poison, poison death. Okay, that doesn't work. Hmm, I guess not. You can't, like, jump right on that... ...that edge here. No. Alright. Maybe there's a way, but we'll leave it. Oh, this is going to be kind of sketchy. Oh, right. Wait, does this... I guess you just hit it again. I thought it was automatic. Uh... Guess just jump past those, yeah. 
playing this game as if it's your first time. It's been how many months? Like three, four, five months since I played this? Of course I don't remember every little detail about it. Oh, man. Oh, no. Well. Okay, that one just goes back. The other ones don't. Aimed in a weird manner. I'm not sure if you're supposed to get up there. No, probably not. Oh, I see. That's what you're supposed to do. Alright, careful of the, the purple water. I guess these streams are also going to be kind of more chill streams because there's not too much to talk about when playing a game again. I don't really need to comment on much. Okay, that does like no damage. Oops, wrong one. Comment on food. I don't eat food. It's a human thing. Disgusting. Well, today I had a pasta salad. There you go. That's that's the extent of my food talk. Yeah, that's Tim's job. Tim's job is talking about how much McDonald's and pizza he gets. So I don't even want to bother with that. Uh, up to the left is... Oh yeah, this is just going back. Wait, what did I get for this? What was the point? I was not paying attention. I did something. I guess lowered the, the water? Yeah, so now I can go to the right. Okay. Well, I'll take the cheese where I can get it. I 
Can you also get the secret below? I don't remember the secret below. Which one you mean? Like back to the left now or to the right? Like I, I probably don't remember 80% of the secrets. Oh, that one. Yeah. Uh, what's down here? Oh, there's that. That's good. Oh, this is really dangerous. Oof, man. Oh, no, my, my health! <laughs> God damn it. Uh, do we go left or right? I guess both, probably. This is not for right now, is it? I don't think so. Shit. Yeah, I think we need the dash. I think dash is from the right. Oops, pressing the wrong button. Ah, oh, damn. Whoa! What even... What is doing that? Huh? Is he stuck? Oh my god, he's like underneath here. Is that a secret? Uh, that doesn't seem right. I think he's outside of the map. Been there, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's not right. And we don't need to get up to this guy. Uh-oh. I don't remember where the water is. Oh boy. I thought there was poison water somewhere here. Yeah, down here? No? Isn't there poison water here during the spirit trial or something? I want to say. I guess we don't need to activate these, but might as well. I'm not gonna bother doing them. Are all spirit trial rewards just spirit light? Or is there one or two that actually reward something else? Whoops. Oh my god. They're all just light. Alright. Man, okay, alright. Maybe I should just not fight this guy. Yeah, like, not having the hammer is gonna be a pain for armored targets. Yeah, I see the dash. It's in reach. What the hell happened to my double jump? I couldn't, could only jump once there. Alright, now we get some mobility at least.
Yeah, this game certainly isn't glitch-free, which is kind of, like, surprising, honestly. Not that there's many glitches, but they do happen from time to time for seemingly no reason. Just out of nowhere. This is a secret of some kind, isn't it? Just spared light. Here we go. That'll help. Play it safe with a purple water, just in case. Is the guy still here? Trapped? No, he seems to be gone. Yeah, there he is. That's where he's supposed to be. Ooh, hold on. God, this is kind of overwhelming. Cheese it here. Oh, no, no. I don't know if I touched the water there. I have no idea, but I'm dead anyway. Man, yeah, the, the flying enemies are so bad in hard mode when they, they hit so fast and they kill you in two hits. God. And it's not like we can just get out of here. Because this guy is like gatekeeping. Guess I can heal here. If only we could equip the uh, more damage to flying enemies shard eventually. Man, poison water one might be screwed, like doubly so. We'll have to see. Again, it's really not the priority right now, I feel. Yeah, I wonder if you can cheese this somehow without having the dash. Probably not, but that would be one hell of a skip. Uh, how do we do this again? Just normally, okay. Oh, wait, but I have to, like, do... Ne never mind, I thought that was foreground. I thought I had to open it some other way first. Yeah, it would be nice if there was some kind of counter in the menu that showed you you have touched poison water or you haven't touched it. Like in, in this screen or maybe in the paw screen where you get the uh, the wolf and stuff in the bottom left. If there, there was some indicator here, maybe there is and I just don't have it anymore. Even if you could, you have to lower the poison water. Uh, no, I don't think you, you do. Not in that sense, anyway. But yeah, it probably isn't a thing. All right, this guy. I mean, he wasn't terrible as far as I remember. Oh god, I should not have done this. Oh, okay, I have to jump a bit farther for that. 
should heal when he's turning around. Wow, that reaches very far. Ooh, that heal heals a lot. Yeah, so you kind of need to dash there on that one. I could probably go for more hits. Yeah, definitely. You can go for almost two full combos. Well, sometimes. Yeah, not a bad boss. Oh yeah, these can break these kind of rocks. So I suppose that's what you have to do for the most part. Already get the bash, yeah? I kind of don't remember all this stuff, but like you get all of the things you had in Ori 1 very, very early on. Oh. Wait, hold on. That is what you do, alright? To take care of this guy, he's gonna be a problem. Pretty sure there was a secret up to the right as well, but that was probably just spirit light. But I guess maybe I should check it. Oh no, this thing, which I think I cheesed, right? Like you're not actually supposed to uh to get it right now, but you can. Yep. Or maybe you are supposed to do that, I don't know. Either way, that's good. Ow. Oh, careful. Oh, I cheese it before the bash? I see. No, oh, that's just that. I'm always scared of going down, because you can't look down, and there might be poison water. Yeah, I think I, think I might have gotten that without bash. By, like, doing a weird dash jump or something. Oh, this is, this is just nothing. Uh, I think there's, like, a collectible or something over here, but yeah, kind of pointless.
Nice aim, buddy. Yeah, the hook shot will be nice to get as well. Ow. Ah, uh, hold on. Retreat. Just heal up quick. That's all it was, of course. There we go. Frog time. Nice. I already skipped that. And then this is poison water too, so I don't want to do that. And we're going just back, I, I guess? Yeah. To the mill. So we're going... Uh, was it up here? Or something? Where you went to the, the town? Either way, we're going left, not right. Ah, I see. Imagine if they hadn't been here. I would have been stuck forever. Or he would just never have been able to do anything. Whoa. Okay, couldn't sit on that. Well, at least now I can actually take three hits. Well, two hits without dying from uh, thorns. That's nice. Alright, that I'll just ignore. Careful. Damn it. Oh, man. Oh, my God, please. Like, trade quests is something you should do in case you miss something later? What do you mean by that? I don't remember what you get for the trade quest. Is that the one where you, like, get the thing so you can just see everything on the map? That you can also buy with Spirit Light? Yeah, that's it. Okay, yeah, that's a good idea to do. Though, I don't really remember... Most of the trade quest, I think. But we'll see. Can I go to the right here? Is that a secret? No. Here we go. Still poison water here, so gotta be careful. But we'll see. If that even ends up mattering. Wanderer's Pouch. That was for like a herb gathering one, I think. Wait, but I can buy these, right? It's only don't use spirit light to buy stuff. This doesn't count. So I can repair the well. Right? I mean, it just... It says spirit light, I think. Yeah, without equipping a shard, without spending spirit light. So this should be fine. Hello. 
And this guy wanted a hat. Oh no. No, that's that's the home guy. Is this hat guy? Yeah. Don't think I really need to talk to most of these, but might as well. Give the map to the bird? Yeah, I got the pouch for the herbs. But I don't remember where the herb guy was. Oh yeah, this one I cheesed as well, I think. Using some bash. Like this guy. Ah, crap. But it, it I think it's a spirit light. But I'm just gonna try it one more time. Oh, man. I'm gonna, just gonna try it one more time. There we go. Yeah. Thought so. Did I need that guy? Well, only for a spirit light. So it doesn't matter. And to the left is some things, some collectible, but I don't think that's anything important. And to the right is something as well. Let's just ignore most of these things. And this is the bear. Oh, I thought that was a side quest. Never mind. Uh, we can jump that, I guess. Yeah. I'm scared. There's poison water everywhere. It's not too much longer, but I guess it's the entire dungeon here, which is full of poison water. But yeah, so I guess, like, in worst, uh, worst scenario, or in the worst case, and I don't get this now, it's not that bad of an achievement to get again. It's like, maybe two hours, probably less than that if you actually, uh, just go fast. And the escape sequence, yeah. But does that one have poison water? I can't remember. Isn't that one just like spikes and stuff? Because that's after you've cleared the water or? No, maybe not. Wait, and down here, is that just a secret? I think that's just a secret. With a bunch of poison. Oh no, maybe that's, maybe that's how you get this turning again. I don't remember. Yeah, isn't it down there that I actually do get the... No, no, it's to the left here that I get this turning. I don't know, I'm just not remembering most of this. No? You open the door there? Yeah. So this is just a secret, so this one I don't need to do. So we do need to go down to get the wheels spinning. Oh, 
Damn it. Oh boy, here we go. What the hell? What were you aiming at? Yeah, I'm scared. Here we go. Poison. Uh. Oh, yeah, I just break it here. And then we just go. We do not need to go to the right. Okay. Uh, wait, do I? Oh. Or can I just jump all the way over here? No, I can't make that jump. Do you have to jump this way? I guess you do. To bash into the center. Yeah, that's not too bad. Just a bit scary. Wait, and then where do we go? Uh, I can't get up and bash on that. Can you actually jump out? I mean, I, I guess. I don't know what the intended way is there. Really? Can't skip? Nope. Not allowed to skip this one, apparently. Alright, now let's be careful. In here. Yeah, it's very important to see them going on a raft. Oh boy, I'm gonna shoot straight into the water at some point. Isn't this also just a an extra thing I can't really remember or maybe it's a a thing to get something turning no this is this just spirit light no there's no way there's must be more to it does this count as touching purple water oh god those beams oh that that's what it was so it was kind of pointless Hold on, I should just get this. Just in case. Damn it. Oh boy, this is going to be a hard jump. Eh, maybe not. I guess I can just do this here. Yeah.
Uh, is this a secret? Don't really remember. Are we going up left or... I think that might be a secret. And we're actually going here. Yeah, I think so. And over here. Can't remember what that does. Ah. Ow. No, no, no. Didn't want to do that. Yeah, I guess you can't get up there without the hook shot. Like you. Wait, hold on. Hey, get over here. Okay, you just don't care? You know what would happen if you charge me, and that's why he's not doing it. Fair enough. Yeah, at least so far, it doesn't feel like I'm lacking any damage for not having the, uh, the hammer, even though generally I preferred it my first time through. Alright, hook shot. Okay, fine. Grapple. Whatever game. Climb up here? Or do we just do... Ah, I see. Couldn't quite remember. So now we could get that energy shard. Maybe I should go and get that. Eh. Eh, it's probably fine. I can go get that later on. Right? Because it's it's kind of annoying. Well, I get Okay, never mind. It's not that annoying because we have the grapple. These sections are not too bad anymore. It, you I don't care about. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That was not a place to stand. Yeah, this part isn't bad. Can I cheese that thing? I feel like I might be able to. Yep. Oh, you could get all the way up there? Hold on. There's a life cell in here, right? 
Yeah. Nice. That's useful. We can go there as well. Yeah, it's a bit of a skip, I think. I don't know if you're supposed to do that or not. This is kind of scary, though. Hold on. Yeah, there was nothing up there. Was that all just for the trial? <laughs> I thought that's where you had to go. Yeah, what where is it you go now? This way? No, we can't go in here. Ah. Uh, I see. There's a compass here. I really wish you could use the right stick to look around with a camera. Ah. Uh, I don't really remember this area at this point. Have I been here? No, this is somewhere new. Alright, we might as well go in here. I don't think this entire area is like bonus stuff. Oh yeah, the bag. Oh boy. I feel like I'm gonna get hit by one of these. And if that counts as uh, water, I'm screwed. ran into them. Alright, good. Yeah, again, combat difficulty seems pretty well tuned, at least for hard mode so far. But again, it's probably going to get a lot harder when I don't get access to upgrades and shards. Unlike the later bosses and stuff, we'll have to see. It doesn't seem like enemies are too much tankier, at least. Maybe they are. Can't quite remember. Because, yeah, I usually like difficulty like that, where uh, you still do the same damage, or potentially even more damage, but you also just take way more damage. So it's like punishing mistakes, but rewarding success. You can't heal on this, can you? No, you can. Oh, that was all, all spirit light? Well, I guess we have this turning now. Ow. I'm just gonna ignore you. 
Never mind, I can't ignore you. Well, maybe. Um... Did I have to go down? I think I might have to go down. Yeah. I'm just gonna go down this way. I feel like that's easier. Yeah, here we go. Oh boy, this entire thing. Yeah, this room is kind of tedious. I don't have fond memories of this section. And I think it was just like, pull the lever whenever you see it. There's no reason to ever not pull the lever. Hmm. I see. Nope. There we go. Yeah, I guess it also just felt quite tedious to me because I kept checking every little thing without pulling the levers because I thought, oh, there's going to be secrets. And I do think there is a secret, like right up there. I remember there's a secret, but still, I'm thinking or uh, I'm pretty sure it was only spirit light, so I don't really need to worry about it. Guess we go down again. Oh, shit. So maybe that's a fail then? I don't know. Does that count as purple water? I hope not. And the problem is, if I do fail it, I will never know if it was because of that or because of the uh, the water early on that I may or may not have touched, like, twice. Yeah, it's a purple laser, but it is, like, made of the water, isn't it? Or something similar. Don't really need to bother with that guy. Oh, God. Wait. Uh, I'm going to bother because I don't remember where to go here. What do we do? Ah, there. Grapple. Ow. There we go. Yeah, I think I, I want to keep going until we purify the water today, and then I'll end it off just to see if we maybe get that first achievement, but probably not. Wait, what did that even do? What am I doing here now? I didn't find the compass pouch or anything, did I? Can I enter this door now? Yeah, now this is open. Yeah, there's a spirit light there, but my stubbornness wants to get it anyway. There we go. Oh, 
Don't touch that. At least this is good water. Alright, here we go. Now this section, which I don't really remember, so if there is poison water here, I might be screwed. But I want to say it was mostly just like spikes and stuff. I guess the water is... Okay, there is water. Uh-oh. This might be bad. Think we're done? Almost. Not quite. Didn't even need to use that. There we go. Alright, well, I think I, like, I did that part without touching water. But it probably counted for one of the other two. Or three moments where I think I might have touched water. But we'll see. Maybe it doesn't pop up until once you get control. Come on, fingers crossed. Please. Give it to me. I don't think I got it. I got it! Hey, there we go! Nice! Okay, they really, like, kept that going for a long time. You could have had that trigger for after the Great Escape, like, at the same time as that achievement. Yeah, nice! Okay, so we're actually on on the, the path to greatness here. So one is done, now it's just these three that I'm, like, concerned with. I am definitely not concerned with the speedrun on hard mode, but yeah, cool! So we'll see if these are impossible or not. Not impossible, but like, are they too annoying? Because if so, I can... 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 Not turn down the difficulty? I thought you could turn down the difficulty. Maybe you, you do it on the, uh, the main menu. You probably do. Let's see. Yeah, this one. Difficulty hard. No? You can't change the difficulty? I thought you could. I mean, I guess maybe that was only in Ori 1 you could do that, or... I don't know. Don't really remember. Difficulty change. Can you change difficulty? It's a yes or no question! I don't need a fucking article! God damn it! Just tell me yes or no. No, you have to restart. Okay, you can't change it mid-game. Alright, that's too bad. That was an Ori one. I, I wonder why they didn't include that, because I think that's a really good, uh, good uh, idea or like implementation in Ori one, where it's like, if you go from hard to normal or easy, then you can never get the hard mode achievements again on that save file, but who cares if you just want to make it easier, so... Bit of a shame that you can't just switch over, so I guess I'm stuck here in hard, so instead of 
instead of hard mode, like if hard mode gets too hard and I don't feel like I can progress, then I'm going to have to give up on the spirit light and the shard one, I suppose, just to beat hard mode. Because I was hoping I could just give up on hard mode because I don't really care about that one. These other two sound more fun to actually accomplish, but yeah, I don't know. You get a freaking article, yep. Gotta be an article for everything with like ad space and uh, and clicks and all that stuff. Word counts. Anyway, pretty good progress. Got the first achievement. Got uh, how much? 11%. Okay, that's not that great, but still, it's something. We'll uh, probably do more Ori next weekend, I would imagine. Tomorrow, I'm almost certainly gonna start with some Witness Randomizer. Starting up the Expert Seed for uh, for my name again. I think I'm gonna use the same one. What, it, what is it? Like 189317? Something like that? I can't remember. But yeah, we'll be doing that. And uh, seeing how punished I get. And then I haven't really decided on what else. Maybe some more Fez. Maybe I'll want to do some Hat in Time or Risk of Rain. I have to see. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you tomorrow or next weekend. Bye-bye.